hello everyone today i'm making a lemon pound cake my large one i'm using a 25 centimeter um, angel food cake pan you can use um, a loaf pan and it makes two loaf pan cakes one second show you so you can use the glass one the pyrex one this is this recipe yields two of these or you can use the, the metal pans, okay? Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is you must grease your pan with butter and flour or you can use the spray. Okay. I've got here um, 340 grams of room temperature butter. And before I start with that, I'm going to switch on my oven to 170 degrees Celsius. Let me repeat, 170 degrees Celsius. Okay, so remember this is for a big, large cake. And whenever I make cakes, guys, you must know it's an occasion. It's someone's birthday, a family member, or a friend or they've asked me to make something, or I'm gifting someone, or just, you know, for the fun of it. But it's always to share. So, like I said, it's quite a large uh, batter. So I use three cups of caster sugar. I'm gonna loosen the butter now quickly. One second guys okay so I'm gonna add half of the sugar and just mix it through The rest of my sugar. And now I'm going to mix this and beat it until it's light and creamy for 10 minutes. Okay. Okay, guys, now I'm going to add five eggs one at a time. So one egg. And then I'll mix it through. Then I'll just continue with the rest one at a time okay and I'll mix that one until all five eggs are incorporated okay so the rest of the ingredients are quite simple it's three cups of cake flour a cup of milk Uh, two teaspoons of vanilla, one teaspoon of baking powder, half a teaspoon of salt. Now you stop right there if you want to make just a vanilla pound cake. Ne? But we're going to make a lemon one. So I've taken off the zest from this lemon and I'm going to squeeze out from half of the lemon the juice. Now, when you add extra liquid, you're going to, at the end, when you mix the flour, add a tablespoon or two of extra flour, just to make up for that. Okay? And now we're going to add the flour first. Half of the flour. You can add it in thirds as well. Give it a slight mix. for a few seconds mm. guys I 
Das ist ein Xamote. And then I'm going to add half of my milk. That's the one cup of milk. So I'm going to add now the vanilla. You can add one or two teaspoons of vanilla. That's up to you. Mix this through. And the rest of my flour. And then also my baking powder. And my salt. Sorry, that was the salt, half a teaspoon of salt and a teaspoon of, level teaspoon of baking powder. of my milk my lemon zest and a lemon half a lemon I'm gonna keep this all for the lemon drizzle that I'm gonna make later on Nice lemon cake. extra tablespoon of flour okay I also want to just always while you're busy just bring the batter in with a spatula okay I'm gonna fold in the rest of the flour Okie dokie, my oven is nice and hot. Just mix this through. I love the consistency of my batter. Nice, and now I'm going to transfer it into my greased pan. It's um, well spread out. Okay, so now I'm going to even out my batter. And make sure you take a, a paper towel or cloth and just wipe these bits off, which I'm going to do now. Then I'm also going to run a knife through the batter, get rid of some of the air bubbles. Make it nice and even. This is a 25 centimeter 
angel food cake pan for those who want to know I also use this for my angel, angel food cake um, cake that is why it has these lips this little feet but I'll be making a video of that One second, guys. Okay, now I'm just gonna take my knife and just run through it a bit. Get rid of any extra air bubbles. Here we go. Okay. Now this goes into my preheated oven, like I said, 170 degrees Celsius for an hour and 15 to 20 minutes. Do not open the oven. So let it just bake away. And like I said, don't open the oven door. Only after an hour and five minutes, then you can take um, about, then you can check it. But after an hour and 15 minutes, you can take a knife or a skew and Press in the center, see if it's done. Remember, all ovens are not the same. And when your knife comes out clean, your cake is done. Okay, and we'll be right back. Okay, so here's the cake out of the oven. And um, now I'm going to cool it in the pan for about 10-15 minutes. And then I'm going to take it out and put it on a plate to cool off completely. Okay guys, so it has cooled off. So I've just flipped it over. And there we go. Nice break. It's nice and soft. You see? Let it come on. See? Okay, now I'm just going to cool off and then I'm going to make the lemon um, icing. Pour it over and then we're going to cut and look inside. Okay guys, we're back. I got about a cup of icing sugar. It's gonna go through it. Uh, I forgot to serve now this icing sugar. I'll just go through with the with the whisk. And here I've got about um, a third of a cup of, I mean a quarter cup of fresh lemon juice. I'm not gonna throw all of it. Just throw half of it in. And. Um, the smallest dash of vanilla essence, just a drop. Okay, there we go. I'm not making a lot because the cake is already sweet. Now I'm just going to mix it. There we go. It's a nice thin one, not too thick. Okay. Maybe I'll add a bit more ice in the I think I don't want it too thin. About a quarter cup of icing sugar I added in. So you make it as thin or as thick as you like. And that's always going to depend on you. So you can just add or take away. What did I say now? Add or take away? No. Louis, Louis and his friends are all here. One second, guys. Okay, now we're going to finish off the cake. Just uh, one second, guys. Okay, I've just got some lemon zest. Pop a 
was watching a movie inside, enjoying myself. If you hear any noise, okay. Now we're gonna cut into it. <laughs> Just cutting a big, big piece so you can see better in the middle. go my lemon pound cake hope you enjoyed this video and I'll be back again with another video soon <laughs> look at that yummy in my tummy <laughs> bye everyone I hope you enjoyed this video and there's the cake on the inside here we go okay Bye everyone, love you. <laughs>